let's go back to like our OG days, like when I used to just like review makeup on hair only. So like the title says today, we're gonna be trying this new product. It's the Too Faced Born This Way Healthy Glow Moisturizing Skin Tint. It has watermelon plus apple hyaluronic. Okay, you know what? Sometimes I feel like it's like, is watermelon and apple on here? Someone on here actually asked me if I would try this. And I got this in the Sephora sale. I was like in Sephora just browsing the other day. And I was like, oh, you know what? I should try that. So I just happened to pick it up. Yes, we have braids in now. If you have any questions about them, I will link the tutorial down below in the description bar, okay? I will be returning it if I don't like it. This is what the packaging looks like, okay? So she is just, do we have a thumbnail shot? Plastic packaging, which I like packaging like this. Uh, it's very similar to the Dior, um, I think it's called like the Skin Glow foundation um so yeah i have the shade chai which i want to say is like maybe it's one of the darker shades i will say that i don't think it's the darkest shade but it's one of the darker ones let me just shade match myself so you guys can see when i tried this in store i shade match myself like to the like this area on my face you see like you can't even see it it's gone voila gone that that was what had me sold to be like okay i need to pick her up some details about it so it's light coverage so you should not be getting like full coverage vibes from this um it's oil free it's a serum foundation um okay so on the on the sephora app the highlights let me screenshot this so y'all can see the confusion <laughs> It says it's a light coverage in the highlights, but then when you look under like the about this product section, it says medium coverage. So I don't know. Let's say light to medium. I'm gonna squirt some out onto my little thing here. This is how much I put on there, can you see? And it, she's a runny gal. Can I just tell y'all, it's so embarrassing how long it's been since I've washed my makeup brushes. It's embarrassing. I'm gonna use this little brush I got from Minted. They so kindly sent it over to me because it's like one of the only clean like brushes. <laughs> and I'm just gonna start to dab this on. Ooh, when I, I don't know if this is brush or the product. It feels great because I've never used this brush before either. It has a little bit of a scent to it too, which I don't know if I'm a fan of. A lot of like Chanel and Dior foundations have a scent to them and I'm like not a like fan of that. So this side of my face has like one layer of it on and this side has nothing on. I would say that's a pretty good shape match for one. Two, this feels exceptional on the skin. I'm very shocked. I, I wasn't, I don't know what I was expecting, but I wasn't expecting that. Like... It just looks like my skin, like, but it's not super duper dewy. It's not super matte. Also this brush, like this video isn't even about this brush. Go get this brush from Minted. I have a discount code for you guys too. This brush is exceptional. Like I'm gonna get another one of these so I have multiples. This brush is great. I love this thing. And it's just like, it doesn't say like what it is, but yeah. We like it. I do have um, hyperpigmentation on my cheeks. So I am gonna go back to like, see like how much coverage I can get out of it. That first layer looks scrum de yum yum, purr purr. Like, <laughs> it looks so nice. It looks so nice. And it's such a good shade match. The way I think of like shade matching too, not only do I want like the foundation to match like the skin on my face, I also hold my hands up to my face. If my hands look like a completely different color than my face, I don't care if I do feel like it's matching exactly. I'm like, okay, it's not a shade match. I have just like a little bit left, you see here on my little thing. I'm gonna try to go over my hyperpigmentation and see like what kind of additional coverage I can get out of this. This feels like it would be amazing for the summertime for just like day-to-day -day wear. 
Okay, so I didn't really add too much coverage on our cheeks. Okay, the postman is out there. That's why I heard up. Love this. Like, I just love how this sits, looks, feel on my skin. Like, it just looks like skin. It just looks like skin. It looks so good. A blotting test for like certain type of found like foundations and stuff. Just to see like how much pout or product is gonna come off with no setting powder. So I just have my little tissue. I usually do this with oil blotting sheets, but I cannot find them right now. Um, that's how much product came off with no setting powder. I'm gonna get a fluffy brush and take a little bit of the banana setting powder. Just a little bit. I know this is gonna have a little bit of color on it. We're just gonna see, does it give off that same amount of like color payoff with a setting powder? Okay, very light. I think it would be like nothing if I hadn't put that setting powder on there, but this is with, this is without. So definitely wanna set her during the day. If you like just want it to like stay there, like especially if you're wearing white, you know, summer whites is a thing. All right, y'all, so this is our finished makeup look with the foundation or the skin tint. I love it. I love it. I think it's amazing. It feels so good on the skin. And I feel like this is kind of like a medium beat. Like it's not a full, full, full glam, but it's not a light glam either. And I feel like this is perfect for like, if you want just like, everyday something with like a little bronzer or whatever because you saw how it looks by itself but you can also glam it up a bit there are some products that are like so light that like it doesn't even look right if you try to put a full glam on with it or like a medium glam you know um but this looks so nice i really enjoyed it i definitely think it's worth the money i'm not going to be returning it because i think it performed like really really well and it stood up to like my standards so i hope you guys enjoyed that thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you next time